issues. In particular, it looks like this article, California GOP rejects effort to strip abortion, same-sex marriage from the platform. Who are the ones that were pushing this? Well, it's so interesting. So a, a within the platform committee, which is up to 200 people, there's a le- there's a drafting committee that is elected from the platform committee. And there was a circulated um, slate that was called the leadership slate that was, you know, basically a lot of social liberals in the party. Some of these folks are my friends. We welcome their vote in the party. But in terms of what the platform is, the platform is not for going door to door and knocking on doors to convince unconvinced voters. It's for the base. It's for the volunteers. It's for our core conservative activists. It's the heart. It's the constitution of the party, if you will. And so to water that down means that what you're trying to do is pander to the left or Democrat voters and not considering the expense to our base. And so, you know, for me, both ideologically, I am a conservative and that's why I'm in the party. I don't think that trying to make ourselves Democrat light is in any way going to help us either win elections or be morally correct. And so I did lead this effort with a couple of other conservatives in the party. Um, So even though the drafting committee produced this liberal draft, the grassroots of the party united. We had people in the room. We had a concerted effort. And by the end of the day, the morning of the vote, we had the legislative leaders in California, as well as three members of Congress on our side. And it really was a snowball effect. And the other side just kind of retreated and lives to fight another day.